Hello and welcome to War Secrets channel. European aircrafts are known for their sustainability and fearful performance. One such aircraft, designed by the Airbus military wing of the renowned company, has been purchased by a lot of countries of their air forces. And this aircraft has contributed greatly to their transportation and mobility of troops and vehicles. Yes, you must have guessed it by now. We are talking about Airbus A400M Atlas. In this video, we will tell you about the amazing military transport aircraft in complete detail. So without any further delay, let's get started. The A400M, previously known as the Future Large Aircraft, is a military transporter built to suite the needs of the air forces of Belgium, France, Germany, Spain, Turkey, Luxembourg, and the United Kingdom. In 1993, a European staff objective was established, along with a memorandum of agreement signed by the governments of the seven states. Italy withdrew from the program. Airbus Military SL of Madrid, a subsidiary of Airbus Industry, is responsible for the management of the A400M program. Let us know about the history of this ambitious program. In May 2003, Airbus and the European Procurement Agency OCCAR, secured a deal for the 202 aircraft development and manufacture. France, Germany, Italy, Spain, the United Kingdom, Turkey, Belgium, and Luxembourg signed at first. As a result, the order was cut to 180 aircraft, with delivery beginning in 2009. These lasted until 2020. The first metal cut for the A400 airframe occurred in January 2005, and assembly commenced in 2007. The maiden flight was supposed to take place in early 2008. However, it was pushed back due to engine development issues. The first A400M aircraft was delivered in June 2008. The aeroplane took off weight 127 tons and carrying 15 tons of test equipment, including 2 tons of water ballast. Its maximum takeoff weight is 141 tons. In January 2009, EADS suggested delaying the first A400M deliveries until 2012 and developing a new strategy for the A400M to explore new methods to advance the program. We'll tell you about the amazing design of the transport aircraft now. The A400 has a significantly greater payload than a C160 Transall and a C130, and it is built entirely of composite materials. The requirement includes the ability to land and take off from short, soft fields, and the aircraft features six wheel, high flotation main landing gear. The requirement for airdrop and tactical flying necessitates good low airspeed flight, as well as long range, high cruise speed for quick and flexible deployment. The composite carbon refined plastic CRP wing box is being finalized at Airbus UK in Filton. The sophisticated carbon composite wing spars were provided by the GKN Aerospace of the United Kingdom. Dental Aviation of South Africa supplied a fuselage top shells and wing fuselage fairings, while EADS supplied a 7 meter by 4 meter composite cargo door. The fuselage is being assembled at Airbus Deutschland in Bremen, Germany. The A400M aircraft is finally assembled at EADS CASA in Seville. The Military Transporters Cockpit the cockpit of this A400M aircraft is completely night vision capable and can accommodate two pilots as well as an additional crew member for special mission equipment operations. It has a fly-by-wire flight control technology designed for the Airbus series of passenger airliners. Two side stick controls are mounted to provide the pilot with a clear view of the electronic flying displays. The throttle controls are located in the center of the cockpit between the two pilot stations. Dallas and Dale Avionics System are developing the FMS 400 Flight Management System for the A400M, which is based on integrated modular avionics modules and is an adaptation of technologies used on the Airbus A380 aircraft. The avionics include cockpit control and display system with 9 6 in 2 displays and a digital head up displays that feature liquid crystal display LCD technology and enhanced vision system EVS for enhanced situational awareness, automated CG calculation, automated defensive aid systems, simple EMCOM switching, simplified switching, and cluttered screens, and automated tanker and receiver fuel management. The A400M for Germany is outfitted with an EADS military aircraft terrain masking low-level flight, TMLLF system for low-level flight control. The TMLLF system is equipped with the SAAB Avitronics flight computer, 
A digital map generator from EADS Defense and Security Systems is also installed. EADS Defense Electronics offers a military mission management system, MMMS, which contains two mission computers. The MMMS is in charge of cargo handling and delivery, as well as computing the load plan and computed air release point prior to an airdrop, as well as fuel management and operational ranges. The MMMS is also in charge of Tactical Ground Collision Avoidance System T-CGAS and Military Civilian Communications. Let us know about the performance and countermeasure technology that comes equipped with the A400M. The A400 regular M's operating speed is 555 km per hour, with a top speed of 780 km per hour. The aircraft's regular and ferry ranges are 3,298 km and 8,710 km respectively. The maximum service ceiling is 11,300 m. The aircraft's takeoff and landing distances are 980 m and 770 m respectively. The aircraft weighs around 76,500 kg with a maximum takeoff weight of 141,000 kg. The EADS Defense Electronic Defensive Aids Package comprises an ALR 400 Raider Warner produced by Indra and AEDS, an MIRAS Multicolor Infrared Alerting Sensor Missile Launch and Approach Warner developed by EADS and Thales, as well as shaft and flare decoy dispensers. Later, a laser DI RCM, direct infrared countermeasure system, might be incorporated. The aircraft may also be outfitted with armor plate for crew protection, bulletproof windscreens, engine exhaust treatment for reduced infrared emissions, and inert gas explosions and fire retardation in fuel systems. The wings contain hardpoints for electronic warfare pods and refueling pods to be installed. Now comes the most important aspect of any transport aircraft, the cargo system. The Loadmaster Control System for Electronic Cargo Control is supplied by Ryan Mantle Defense Electronics, a workstation and control panel, eight sidewall lock panels, and a crew door panel comprises the Loadmaster. It offers effective ground loading as well as aerial freight drops, military helicopters and vehicles, heavy engineering equipment, pallets, and freight containers are among the payload needs. Up to nine conventional military pallets, 2.23 meter by 2.74 meter, including two on the ramp, as well as 58 men seated along the sides, or up to 120 fully equipped troops sat in four rows, maybe transported in the cargo area. It can transport up to 66 stretchers and 25 medical staff for medevac. The A400M can transport 116 paratroopers, their equipment via parachute or gravity extractions. It can drop single cargo weighing up to 16 tons, multiple loads weighing up to 25 tons, 120 paratroops plus a wedge load weighing 6 tons, or up to 20 one-ton containers or pallets. It can also drop paratroops and freight, RAS or wedge or door loads at the same time, as well as very low-level extraction. VLLE of single load up to 6.35 tons or multiple loads of up to 19 tons total weight. Gravity extraction may be conducted on a single load weighing up to 4 tons or on several loads weighing up to 20 tons total weight. The cargo compartment can be set up for cargo, vehicle or personal transfer, airdrop, a combination of these or aeromedical evacuation. A single load master can rearrange the cargo compartment in flight or on the ground for various tasks. A motorized crane plays in the rear portion of the fuselage ceiling as a 5-ton capacity for loading from the ground and cross-loading. The rear opening door features a complete compartment cross-section to facilitate actual load movement, roll-on and roll-off loading, and big load airdrop. The aircraft also comes with a refueling facilities. The A400M can be converted into a tactical tanker in two hours, allowing it to refuel a variety of planes and helicopters. Fly refueling is delivering the 908E wing pod drogue system, which offers a fuel flow of up to 1,200 kg per minute for each pod, as well as the rear cargo bay centerline pallet mounted hose drum unit, which provides a fuel flow of 1,800 kg per minute. Furthermore, 
up to two cargo bay fuel tanks CBT that are directly connected to the A400M's fuel management system can be installed. The total fuel capacity is 46,000.7 tons or 58 tons when the CBTs are used. The engines are also very powerful. In May 2003, Airbus military chose the three-shaft TP400 D6 turboprop engine produced by Europrop International (EPI), Rolls-Royce UK Germany (ITP), Spain (MTU Germany), and Snecmo have established the EPI collaboration France. Rolls-Royce is in charge of total integration. Each of the four engines has a maximum output of more than 11,000 horsepower. According to EPI, these are the biggest turboprops ever built in the West. FADEC, Full Authority Digital Engine Control, is installed in the engines, which are provided by BAE Systems and Hispano Suiza. The landing gear chosen is also impressive. Each main landing gear is made up to three separate twin wheel assemblies, giving each side six wheels. This enables the jet to land on unprepared airport runways. The landing gear arrangement also allows the A400M to kneel, lowering the rear ramp to make loading big trucks easier. Whatever the load, the main landing gear shock absorbers maintain a minimum distance from the ground. We hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please click the like button below, followed by the subscribe button. Finally, the bell button next to you ensures that you never miss any of our content. You may also share our videos and come back to see what else we have to offer. See you in the next video.